uh, a few years back, I had a lady call 911, and uh, when I asked her what the problem was, she had told me that uh, there was a cow mooing in a Moo. field nearby her apartment complex. Moo. And uh, I asked her what Moo. what was the problem with the cow, and and she said she Moo. didn't know, but she's never heard that cow moo like that before. So she thought she thought the cow was in distress, and she wanted the deputy to go and check on the cow and make sure the cow was okay. And I asked her if she's heard the cows uh, moo in the past, and she said yes. She goes, I think something's wrong. Moo. I'd like the deputy to go check on Moo. the cow. So uh, yeah, after talking to her for a bit, trying to figure out you know, if anything else going on besides the cow mooing, and uh, I did determine there's a field right there. So we ultimately ended up having to send a deputy and check on the cow, and the cow was okay. At uh, time when we had a power outage, uh, caller call 911, answer the phone, car said 911, what is the address of your emergency? And he says, um, my power is out. So I inform him, yes, the power is out in all of South Carson, to which he replied, um, can you turn it back on for me, please? There are always emergencies in between non-emergency calls for service, and it does take away from legitimate emergencies.